Welcome to this video that belongs to Lesson 1 of Module 3. My name is Mari Carmen Suárez de Figueroa Baonza and the aim of this video is to introduce the NEON methodology as well as its main components. Let's suppose different cases in which an ontology should be developed. For example, the situation in which an owl ontology in the pharmaceutical domain should be developed. In such a development, it is needed to use several pharmaceutical standards in XML and also classification schemes in a particular format. In addition, it could, ben, it could be necessary to have the final ontology in different natural languages such as English and Spanish. To develop ontologies, there are different approaches. A possibility is to start from the scratch modeling the required domain. In this case, we can reinvent the wheel or even worse, invent the square wheel. Another option is to build the ontology reusing available knowledge resources, such as the databases, thesauries, and so on. In this case, we can save tam time and money, we can promote the use of best practices, and maintain the consensus including in such resources. Therefore, it is clear that the second option is better. In addition, we can build ontologies involving only ontology engineers, or involving people with different backgrounds, like domain experts, final users, software developers, and so on. In this case, having, having a great diversity of point of views benefits the development of ontologies. Currently, in the ontology engineering field, people tend to reuse knowledge resources, to work in collaboration, to develop vocabularies and ontology networks, and also to include multilingual features in ontology. However, these new trends are not covered by classical methodologies, and for this reason, the need of a new methodology for covering such, such trends appears. The new methodology is called the new methodology. The new methodology is a methodology based on scenarios. This methodology is not based on a rigid workflow. That is, it suggests different ways for a variety of situations when building ontologies. The NEON methodology framework provides a set of nine scenarios, which are explained in detail in lesson 2, a glossary of processes and activities involved in the development of ontologies, a collection of life cycle models, and a set of methodological guidelines for different processes and activities. These methodological guidelines include functional, procedural, and empirical knowledge. The aim of this framework is to speed up the, the development of ontologies by reducing available knowledge resources such as ontologies, non-ontological resources, and ontology design patterns. The glossary proposed by the NEON methodology provides the definition and classification of the main processes and activities involved in the development of ontologies. For example, conceptualization, ontology requirement specification, ontology reuse, ontology evaluation, among others. As you can see in the figure representing the glossary, the later one, ontology evaluation, can be divided into validation and verification. The methodological guidelines proposed by the NEO methodology are described with the three following components. A guiding card that provides functional and practical information on each process and activity on the, of the new methodology. This card includes the definition and purpose of the process and activity, the necessary inputs and the generated outputs, who performs the process or activity, and when the process or activity can be performed. Procedural information is also provided in the form of a workflow. This workflow details how to perform the process or activity and contains the inputs, outputs, actors involved and details, methods, techniques and tools that can be used. And finally, empirical knowledge is supplied in the form of a set of illustrative examples that show how the process and activity are performed. Now we will present a summary of what is shown in this video. We are going to continue, but we recommend you to stop and summarize what you have seen in the video. The new methodology is mainly based on the reuse of knowledge resources and the implication of human resources with different backgrounds. 
The new methodology for building ontologies provides a methodological framework based on scenarios, the identification and definition of processes and activities, a collection of life cycle models, and detailed and prescriptive methodological guidelines. Finally, it is recommended to review the additional material available on the platform. Thank you very much for your, your attention. Thank you.